All right, so we just finished the medium on Shutter, and this was released today. Actually, we started watching it last night mm -hmm. because some it dropped at like eleven, or it, maybe even earlier. Mm -hmm. I saw it was on there at eleven. It wasn't supposed to drop till today, and we stayed up till midnight to try to watch VHS ninety four, and it wasn't on there. It didn't come on there till two a.m. because I checked all the way up till two a.m. and it finally dropped at two a.m. But this one dropped at 11. So Shudder's all over the fucking place yeah. with when they drop movies. I don't know. I'm now waiting for the two other Shudder movies that come out tomorrow. And they're not on there. And it's 11.30. So I don't know what fucking time <laughs> they drop these movies. But The Medium is a Thai horror possession film. Mm -hmm. And it is about a young girl named Mink who becomes um, possessed. And she has a shaman in the family mm -hmm. who is a medium, I guess. Yes. Or, that's, a, that's, a, that's, <laughs> that's what that title says. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and, uh, you know, they're trying to uh, get it out of her. I mean, yeah. it's, 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 a, it's an exorcism film, yeah. right? But, and you guys know, let's just say this right up front. So everyone knows if they don't already, if you've watched my channel enough, you know, I'm not a big exorcism fan. Mm. Um, mm -hmm. it's, it's in that same kind of vein as vampire films for me. Um, I, I'm not a big fan, but there's always exceptions and there, there's films that come along, um, in the exorcism subgenre, like, like the last exorcism or something that I just love, you know, or, or the original exorcist or exorcist three. I mean, there's definitely titles, uh, beyond the door, stuff like that. So it's pretty rare though. I, I find them to be extremely. Extremely, extremely repetitive. Like, it feels like the same fucking film every time. Mm. Right? So it's always the girl gets possessed. The priest is finally called in at the end. He does the exorcism. They're like, take me! And then <laughs> they kill, sense. they die, and they take in the little girl or whoever um, recovers, and that's the end. Mm. You know, that's a lot of them. So I have big issues with that. Um, but this is from... The director of Shudder uh, and the Phobia films, one and two, and also the writer of the Yellow Sea, um, the, uh, Chase, the Chaser, and most importantly, The Wailing, which is all three of those are excellent. If you haven't seen them, definitely watch them. And the, the director is solid as well. So I knew that this one had a lot of potential. And I'll go first on this. I thought this was fantastic. I loved this. Uh, this is one of the best horror films of the year for me. I'd put mm. this probably in my top three at the moment. Mm. I thought it was great. Um, you know, it while it can be um, very similar to a lot of exorcism movies, what I really liked about it is that it went all out for it. Like, one of my problems with a lot of exorcism movies, and The Exorcist actually falls victim to this as well, but at least that one was the archetype. And so it's okay that it, it had these issues. Um, but one thing I always want expanded upon within the this subgenre is that there is a demon in this person and it never is able to, like, leave a fucking bedroom. Mm. And it's like... How powerful is this thing? Mm. And you can do the whole vulgar display of power line all you want, like in the original Exorcist. But to me, it's like, I want to see an exorcism movie where this thing gets out in the wild mm. and is fucking people up. Like, I want to see this thing demonic. I want to see this thing taking people over. I want to see this thing killing people. I want to see this thing at its full potential. Mm. We only see it locked in a room in a little girl who's, you know yelling nasty words at people that's True. not enough yeah you know it's it's good in the exorcist because it's a fantastic film um but once that film's made then from there in the exorcist 3 you know you want to see it get loose which is what yeah. happens in that movie mm -hmm. and that's why that movie's great um but a lot of exorcism movies keep it really like you know reserved mm -hmm. and this one goes all out yeah. You know, especially in the end, that last act is fucking wild. Yes. And there's a lot of crazy things that happen, unexpected things, and it really goes for it. it it's mm -hmm. a fucking brutal film at times. Yeah. Um, and no one's off limits to being killed. No one and no thing. Mm -hmm. um, and there's definitely going to be a scene 
a couple scenes that are going to really fuck up some people. Yeah. Like, for sure. if you're sensitive just to some, to some things, <laughs> I don't want to say what they are, but, uh, there's one in particular. I know a lot of, a lot of people are, are, are squeamish about and are like straight up. They don't like it. They yeah. don't want it in the film. Yeah. Uh, and this movie does it in one of the most horrible ways imaginable. Oh my God. Yeah. It was awful. It was yeah. rough. I mean, we were both like, no. Yeah, man. It almost it made was... me like sick. It was yeah. just like, fuck yeah. Jesus Christ. Cause yeah. I'm, I'm putting myself in the real shoes. Right. Of it in the moment, thinking of seeing that and being like, I fucking kill this person. Oh, yeah. I mean, that was her reaction. Oh, yeah. I was like, I'd fucking, I don't dead. care if they're possessed, I'll fucking dead. kill them right there. On <laughs> they're the spot. Murdered right So, what do you think? Yeah, I thought it was really cool. I agree with you. I like that it pushes um, the boundaries and it doesn't really hold anything back. Um, but the ending, the last half of it was definitely really wild and there were some crazy visuals. Like, not crazy, but just really creepy. And I unsettling. forgot to mention it's found footage. Yeah. It's a mockumentary. Cool. Um, so I just want that to be known. Yeah. Sorry for interrupting, but no, that's it's... an important detail because there are people who love found footage yeah. or found footage junkies. And then there's people who detest that mm-hmm. style and want nothing to do with it and wish it would die and go away forever. Right. But, um, and there's definitely moments in the film where it's like, why the fuck are you still filming? Yes. For sure. Yeah. But if you're watching a found footage movie, it, we talked about this. It's one of those things where it's like, Okay. Yes, realistically, they should stop filming, and it does kind of take you out of the movie, but at the same time, you're going to be yelling at the screen, I want to fucking see what's going on, Yes. so I don't want it to be realistic, show me. So you kind of have to find that balance, and you kind of have to allow things, unless they're doing security cameras, where they're not moving, and they'll always be filming, and and they're not attached to somebody who should be putting the camera down and helping, or putting the camera down and running, so there is a, there is stuff there is some of that for sure, but it never bothered me because the scenes were so effective mm-hmm. and what was going on was so interesting and engaging and cool that I didn't give a fuck. But I still was like, why are they why yeah, are they filming? I mean, of course, I'm always going to notice. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, no, and no. Continue. I mean, the, the found footage uh, is another reason why I thought it was really cool too because we didn't. I don't remember if we if we realized that it was found footage no. when we watched, but I yeah. You said that I going said it, in, but I yeah. That it might be, and you were right. I I just didn't know. Yeah. So no, I thought it was really cool, and there's definitely there's like a like you said a couple scenes that are really hard to watch, and then there's um, you know this one scene in particular that is kind of in my brain that was really scary. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, I thought the acting was fantastic too. Um, there was some amazing shots. She doesn't like when people crawl around. No, I don't. Like, humans aren't meant to gallop and run on their hands. At all. And there's a good amount of that in this. (laughs) And she kept yelling, no, don't do that. No, stop stop it, stop it. Ew, ew, ew. But funny enough, though, the scene that I'm thinking of isn't a galloping scene or a crawling scene. Sure, I know. It made made me think of that. Yeah. And there's some really cool shots. Yeah. Yeah. And there's some cool sets. Mm -hmm. Um, And I don't think they're sets. Uh, They just found an abandoned area or whatever Mm -hmm. and used it. But effectively. Yes. Um, and I'm assuming you guys have guessed this by now, but for some of you out there who might not have guessed this by now and are opposed to something like this, the film is subtitled. It, yes. it is in Thai. So um, that might not be appealing to you, but learn how to read. <laughs> um, but man, I, I, thought it was, I thought it was great. Yeah. I really did. I, I'm real high on this one. Hmm. And a huge recommendation from me. Um yeah. Yes. Uh, if you're into found footage, if you're into exorcism movies, if you're into movies that really go for it in the end, um, and surprises, mm-hmm. characters dying that you wouldn't expect, um, people and and things dying that you wouldn't expect in ways that you wouldn't expect, very gruesome. Um, you know, really really good connection to characters. Mm-hmm. I felt connected. I you know even though Mink is possessed throughout I did feel sorry for her oh sure you know yeah. I, I felt bad for her and yeah. in a lot of exorcism movies I don't care mm. I'm like well I know I should care because she's a human but for some reason they were able to sell me mm. on her and the family and it felt real like it felt yes. like a real family it felt like it felt like a real village it felt like you know it felt very authentic in in the way 
that the community was portrayed mm. and their beliefs, right? Because this is a lot, a lot of this film has to do with the questioning of belief in some people mm. and the full faith of others. And, you know, it also has that, you know, obviously it's a foreign film and it's not my country. It has that very foreign feel to me mm. to where I feel like a fish out of water while watching it because it's mm. a culture I'm not yeah. familiar with at all. So a lot of it is is new to me and and, and kind of scary, but also yes. kind of interesting and intriguing. And that's, of course, the interest of going to other countries and and, and stuff like that. So, anyways, um, I, as I said, I, I felt like I don't. If I had to come up with minor gripes or criticisms, it would be like, yeah. why didn't they put the camera down, kind of stuff. Right. But yeah. that's as I said, I kind of already explained that stuff away. I don't, I don't want realism, and I do. Yeah. So it's a tough one, and that's why found footage is rough. Yes. Whoa. <laughs> the video that we put on to change the color went nuts. <laughs> it's a totally it's different party, video, yeah. but whoa. Yeah. Fucking let's party. I could <laughs> I could not have that on. No. It's so... I'm going to have an epileptic seizure. Yeah. <laughs> it's so intense. It's so crazy. Anyways, definitely watch this yes. one. It's currently streaming on Shudder. Uh, get Shudder if you don't have it. There's so many For great sure. things on there. And uh, Shutter needs to send me money at this 100. point. As many fucking 100%. things. And watch if you haven't, if you've never gotten it, I also recommend. I'm gonna have to really quickly recommend. She'll recommend it too. Terrified. Oh my god! It's like the best movie on Shutter. So scariest thing. That's also subtitled. Um, but it's, it's it's fantastic. Oh, it's, it's so scary. It's from Argentina, I think. Argentinian. Think. Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong on that. I'm not sure, but, but watch it's it. phenomenal. For sure, watch so, it. Uh, and there's a lot of other really cool mm-hmm. originals on there. So, watch it. I guess. Bye!